Hi, it's me again with Corel Doll Tips and Tricks, and this is 4B to stay along this same effect. And in the first video, if you watch the first video, if you failed to make a copy of the outline of your text, and I brought in an A to show you because that's going to be a little bit different. If you will go to object and convert the outline to an object, you can grab all this and grab the boundary tool and there's your outline. But if you're gonna fill this in, I'm gonna show you if you fill that in with the, the original yellow, it works. Sometimes if you did that, if you have a letter with an A in it or something like that, that isn't gonna work. So what you can do is take the boundary tool and move that down and you see the, the middle part of the A or any letters missing. Well, if you'll take your smart fill tool and fill that in and then left click, right click, and then two ways you could do it. You could one, you could smart fill that yellow or you could smart fill it and move it out of the way and you could left click and then fill it with, well, you could right click yellow and that's going to fill that in. That won't work uh, if you just try to do the A itself. So there is a, you know, is a way around uh, letters that aren't, you know, well, one, if you, if you, it's still better to make a copy of your text than you could fill it in. But if you've forgotten, you can always use the boundary tool to make boundaries around the text to get you your outside shape. And in this case, it would have worked. You know, we could put the green there, go to object, order, back a page. Of course, we have to take the yellow out. And that's one thing you never want to do is move something. I'm going to move it back. I'm going to nudge that out of the way. I'm going to take away the yellow. And now we got green, nudge that back. And now we, that's not near as pretty, but it would give you a different look. And then like if you wanted an outline like we did in the previous video, just make that outline, have it up. Let's make it, uh, let's hold down uh, F12, make it like 12 points. Let's make it 16, make it a little bit thicker. Okay, make it a light color for the bevel tool to work. It affects bevel. And what you're gonna have to do is, if the bevel tool doesn't work, there's a reason. So you have to convert it to an outline and then it'll work. And it'll give you that bevel looking effect. And then of course, all you have to do is click on it and take it down. And you could do that with any color. I, the you, Well, I say that, the darker the color, the less the bevel is gonna show up. You know, if you do a black, it just doesn't really show up. But if you do a yellow or a light blue, it'll, show, well, let's just do that. Let's make that text light blue. Well, that's the outline. There you go, you got a bevel that's a light blue. Anyway, I hope that helped just a little bit. Thank you for watching.